वेलकम बैक योर वॉचिंग स्टोरी बोर्ड टेट टॉक्स इंडिया नई सोच इज इन फैक्ट टेट टॉक्स फर्स्ट कोलेबोरेशन विद एनी मेजर नेटवर्क दैट विल हैव अ टेलीविजन सीरीज फीचरिंग ओरिजिनल टेट टॉक्स इन लैंग्वेज अदर दैन इंग्लिश इन फैक्ट इट विल प्रेजेंट अ ग्रेट अपॉर्चुनिटी टू स्पीकर्स फ्रॉम ऑल वॉक्स ऑफ लाइफ इंक्लूडिंग साइंटिस्ट आर्टिस्ट ऑन्टरप्रन्योर्स टू प्रेजेंट देयर आइडियाज इन फ्रंट ऑफ अ ग्लोबल ऑडियंस एंड ऑल्सो इंडियन ऑडियंस विल गेट अ चांस टू लिसन टू देयर इंस्पायरिंग ideas we caught up with chris anderson and juliet blake of ted talks to gather their enthusiasm about the new show chris uh, you know i've been a big ted fan for many many years so tell me how different is what i'm going to see on tv compared to what i've seen on video or on youtube or whatever how different is it i think the shocking thing is how much it's the same right. it's kind of the same but dialed up intensified made if anything more engaging right uh more enjoyable more inspiring you know uh i'm going to put your words in your mouth your coffee in your mouth you said <laughs> it's 18 minutes because that's what it, how long it takes for a cup of coffee that's why your <laughs> ted talk is 18 minutes now this is going to be you know with the ad breaks is going to be an hour so tell me in in terms of what you once said how does mm-hmm. this reconcile so so an individual talk um on our website the maximum length of that is 18 minutes right. and many of them are shorter but the way that um ted talks are usually delivered are in sessions that can be an hour or as long as 2 hours right and you, what you see is multiple talks and people don't understand this the actually the impact of watching multiple talks is different it's actually more powerful than watching a single talk Absolutely. because the talks spark off each other ideas are amazing things you know they 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 do different things to your brain when you hear something from one speaker something else from another there's there's a there's a reaction between the two that does something even more so um when we're not worried about the length that a talk a series of short talks that can build up to an hour that that's actually very exciting to see that julian before i come to you i'll stay with sure, chris sure, for one more question totally so tell me uh, chris about india and ideas hmm. tell, tell me how the the two reconcile with each other you know you've now you know this is your first big tv production so to say yes so Why why did you choose India? Finally it's about looking for great ideas. So why was India your decision? Every time I've been here I've been so struck at how hungry this country is for knowledge. Um everyone almost the first question they they ask you is where did you study? What did you study? Um there's a real belief in in the power of education. You've got a generation now that have opportunities their parents never dreamt of. For most of them what they learned was a key part of that. And so I just I just think that that aspiration is very exciting that means that um there's very fertile territory here i think a lots of people would be attracted to the idea of lifelong learning which is really one way to think of what ted is it's it's um it's learning made accessible made inspiring you know made possible for people leading busy lives so you know we we the other piece of course is just the great partnership we found here with with star um but um but it really feels like this place um is is ready for this and and is teeming with great ideas that frankly the rest of the world needs to know about right so tell me about your experience you've been here uh, part of uh, you know the conceptualization of the show you've been you know at the forefront discussing the show even before it's before been, it was commercially it's it's honestly been i mean i've produced hundreds of hours of Absolutely. tv yeah and this has been the best experience i've ever had and um one of the reasons for that is that we have found speakers who are just going to blow everybody's minds i mean they're not all famous by any means there are a very small handful of bollywood um stars right. but they're not in their bollywood personas in the same way that shahrukh is not his normal bollywood uh persona they're giving very authentic talks and we've done a major search across all of india Right. to find people who were doing unique work. So uh, tell me a little more about that search. Well, we hired um the first person I hired on the team was um somebody who I'd worked with before. I made a movie here and I hired the casting director from that film because she's brilliant at finding really unusual people. And so she then hired a couple of other people and they've been working for Ted all this time. And then Fremantle came on board and they have a brilliant team of people. And so we spent a long time with probably lists of maybe 
at least 500 people. And from those long lists of people, we would read about them, we'd look at video of them. We have a lot of TEDx speakers that have come, you know, that have come to us from all over India. Right. So there are at least six or seven people who are TEDx um, speakers who are giving a very different talk to the talks they've given before. A couple of speakers have talked at TED, the main TED stage before, but now they're speaking in Hindi. Right. You know, and they've been overjoyed to be able to speak in Hindi, giving talks where, you know, they've talked on the main stage at TED. But to be able to speak to a Hindi audience has been very special for them. Uh, Chris, tell me, how will, how will this travel? Uh, now, this is a Hindi show, so how will this go across the world? So what are you going to do with it? Are you subtitling it? Are you, what, are, what are you doing with it? Um, when I say I'm, you, meaning the larger team, right, I mean, yeah, not right, right, just right. you. Yeah. I mean, so far, um, um, m the majority of TED Talks recorded have been in English, and right. they have been subtitled into many languages. Absolutely. It's actually been a desire from us for a while to get more talks in other languages, again, translated so that others can benefit from them. I mean, ideas don't, aren't owned by any the one territory. They, they want to cross borders. They want to be free. Yeah. <laughs> and, um, and so what, you know, one of the thrills for me watching some of these episodes is going, wow, that speaker, that idea, so many more people will want to hear about that outside India as well as inside India. So absolutely, we'll be putting um, some of these talks on our homepage of TED.com, right. translating them into English, and will, will, uh, sharing we, them. Will we see branding on them? No. No, we, we won't. No. Yeah. You know, the one wonderful thing about working with Star is that they've really honored the TED brand. Right. So you will see the TED logo, as you would on the TED stage, right. and you will see a studio audience that could equally be in Vancouver at right, TED. Right. So they Except if anything even more passionate. Right. <laughs> yes, I mean the audience, I've never seen an audience listen in the way that the audience has on these shows. Right. And watching the cuts of the shows, you know, we had one speaker who has a woman who has an incredibly powerful talk. And as you look at the audience, I was in the control room looking at all these different monitors, you see women in the audience crying. I mean, it's very powerful. I mean, the content is, some of it's very entertaining and funny, but there are also some very poignant moments. It's just like Ted, there's a mix of everything, and that's what we're all about. Yeah. Chris, what do you think this will do for Ted? I mean, it's a tough question, but what will it do for Ted? I think it's, it may well turn out to be the most exciting thing Ted's ever done. Right. You know, since the day we first put talks on the internet. Um, just because of the scale of what's, what's happening here, it's, it's um, um, reaching out in another language in a country as big as India, really thrilling. So um, if this works the way that we dream it will, it absolutely could lead to us attempting to do the same in other countries. Um, and it certainly really made me excited at the, and actually quite optimistic about the future that like, if we can change the conversation out there from people just shouting at each other and not listening to each other, to people encouraging each other and trying to nudge each other into finding our better selves and to learning from each other. That, that's, that's exciting. Thank you so much and all the best to both of you. Thank all the best you. to, yeah, and enjoy Thank the rest you. of your stay in India. Thank you. Thank you. With that, it's a wrap on Storyboard this week. You can catch all our content on Facebook, Twitter and YouTube. Thanks for watching and we'll be back same time next week. See you soon.